Get ready to do some real shooting, because it's time to play shootout at Old Tucson. So, which one of you is going to be first? Shootout at Old Tucson was an arcade game made by American Laser Games in 1994. The arcade cabinet was based on a 3DO console. Sadly, American Laser Games pulled out from arcade business soon after the release and therefore very few units exist. The known units are in hands of collectors rather than people who care about preservation and therefore less is known and no gameplay footage exists. This bugs me as the game was planned to be released to home systems. It feels to me that I should have played this game but never could as of the game's bad luck. I decided to change this situation. 3DO games are RSA encrypted. The BIOS checks whether a game is encrypted and just plays it if it is. Sadly, the known arcade games are not encrypted and therefore won't play on stock 3DO consoles. I opened my 3DO in order to remove the RSA check from the BIOS. When I opened it, I saw something I wasn't prepared of. My Japanese system has just one SOP44 ROM chip. It is common knowledge that Japanese units have two SOP32 chips. One for the BIOS and one for the kanji fonts. Other regions just have one SOP32 ROM chip and the other space is left free. I thought my chip might be bigger because it could also include the kanji information and probably has the second slot left free for arcade applications. Reading the BIOS was no easy task as the markings on the chip did not reveal me its identity. That meant I had to brute force it. First I explored some pin identities for reference purpose and to shrink the list of candidates. Then I googled all available chips for their properties and condensed a list of possible candidates. I then read the chip, assuming one of these identities at a time, until I got a list of compatible replacements. After succeeding reading the ROM, my suspicion was confirmed. My chip contains both BIOS and kanji fonts. I then hacked the BIOS to remove the RSA track. Afterwards, I wrote the BIOS onto an AMD AM29LV160BB, soldered it back in and set the reset pin high with a jumper wire. All games I own still run fine. But now, I am also able to run the attract mode of shootout at all Tucson. It still needs lots of work as I have to figure out how to interact with the game, as I lack the hardware interfaces that are present in the real arcade cabinet. Nevertheless, I decided to publish this information prematurely, as it brings several new and exciting things to the table, and I don't know how many months it will take me to figure the rest out. Furthermore, I think with too much stuff happening, the episode would have become too big. Longtime supporter of the show, DBN Poldomans, compiled a list of games, which I will try to run very soon for sure too. But as for now, I discovered that a hardware variant exists, which does mix BIOS and kanji fonts onto one chip. This will become interesting for people who own a SOP44 PAL or North American machine. I found out that ROM chips of the 29LV160 variant can be used as 3DO SOP44 ROM chips. Personally tested, I have AM29LV160DB and AM29LV160BB. I was able to correctly read the original ROM chip by assuming the identity of clone chips too. Therefore, I assume a direct compatibility of all clones and moreover all variants of these. The RSA check can be removed from the BIOS. My acknowledgement goes to Taiji Gamer of Atari Age. He is one of the most knowledgeable 3DO enthusiasts in existence. He discussed the details shown here with me, told me about the other SOP44 3DO systems, and it was his idea to tie the reset pin high. 
after the usual ending screen, I will attach the role attract mode of shootout at all to son recorded from actual hardware. This is the end of the presentation. My name is Ben. I thank you for viewing. Pete's gang has more men than you thought. Wake! Help me! That gang is camped right outside of town. <laughs> They're at the blacksmiths. Let's brand them with bullets. There is a train, don't let him escape.
Why, it's Buckshot Bill himself. Time for a shootout. They're hanging out at the tavern. Let's get them. <laughs> 